So shares of Soundhound that AI popped higher on Thursday. After an analyst at Cantor Fisher upgraded the stock to a neutral from underweight. However, price still remains richly valued. Now, this is the monthly chart and what you can see is we do have all time highs at eighteen dollars and you have lows at uh, about a dollar and although you don't have equal lows you can consider this a double bottom now this monthly surge that we saw back in February was due to uh, news of NVIDIA taking a small stake in the company and what we saw was the surge led to a rally base rally and so I'm just going to tighten up that weekly bias level that was formed. Now what we can see is price currently has retraced more than 61.8 percent setting up for a nice level to go long at the weekly bias level at $3.75 which is just below this support resistance band at $4.50. So before we continue with the analysis we're going to look at this video this article. So AI continues to booster the technology spare with soundhound.ai representing one of Thursday's beneficiaries specializing in voice and speech recognition sound. Stock is popping higher now the analyst's name is Brett Knobloch, wrote in a research letter to clients that the recent weakness in sound stock presented a more palatable valuation. He goes on to say, when we downgraded the stock on March 21st, we thought downside risk far outweighed upside risk. Now we believe both downside risk and upside risk are more even, which in our view warrants a change to our writing. Now beyond the valuation argument, the analysts laid out several catalysts that could boost the stock. They include a meaningful acceleration in business fundamentals. For example, last month SoundHound announced that its voice AI system will be integrated into vehicles in Japan. Now as we talk about the valuation, according to Guru Focus, the stock currently trades at a trailing year sales multiple of 25x. That's higher than the 96% of the enterprises listed under the software industry. So trades a lot higher in terms of premium valuation relative to its peers. As a counterpoint, one of the bullish arguments for sound stock is that the underlying enterprise should see significant top line expansion. Data compiled by Yahoo Finance reveals that experts project current fiscal year revenue to hit 69 million. Alright, so even at those lofty targets, the revenue per share, assuming December 2023's shares outstanding count of 229 million, would come out to 0.46x, dividing this ratio by the current share price, uh, gives you a revenue multiple of roughly 10x. So currently, Wall Street analysts rate the stock a moderate buy, however, the assessment is rather contested breaking down as four buys one hold and one sell now getting back to the weekly chart as price retraced it did form this weekly sell level I'm going to take this off the chart now so we can see that weekly sellers at we'll say six dollars even so this tells me that your raw to risk ratio is limited because now you have something in the way if price resumes its upward trend 
Now let's look at those zones a bit better on the daily chart. You can see how we had this gap retest before price resumed this impulse move down. So here are your two levels to watch. Sub four dollars and six dollars. Thanks for watching, subscribe, please like the video.